Hey everyone, this is Brian Fitzgerald with Dolt Hub, and today we're going to talk about why we think Dolt is just an easier database to operate. Um, for those of you who aren't familiar with Dolt, Dolt is a new database built from the storage engine up, designed for uh, fast diffing. Uh, to use Dolt, though, is simple. We've, uh, we're working on copying the MySQL syntax, so it's 100% MySQL compatible uh, is our goal. And then we are also copying the Git like version control. So if you know MySQL and if you know Git, you'll you will know uh, Dolt. Dolt itself is a database that you can download and use locally. And then we also have a hosted version coming soon for those of you who don't want to manage and run uh, your own database. We also have Dolt Hub. Dolt Hub is where you can manage your Dolt databases online. Uh, we've created a web um, UI with an SQL editor and where you can manage pull requests just like you would on GitHub if you're familiar with that. You can have public or private repositories on uh, Dolt Hub. Dolt Lab is for those of you who don't want to have your data on the internet at all, you're able to download um, the self-hosted version of Dolt Hub. Um, Dolt, Dolt Lab and Dolt Hub are all free and open source, and there is a cost for private repositories and hosted Dolt. So anyway, today what we're going to talk about is why we just think Dolt is an easier database to operate. Um, one of our missions at Dolt is to make, uh, and Dolt Hub is to make databases uh, not scary and accessible uh, to everyone that needs to have access to an, uh, throughout the organization and not wait on a database administrator to get you the information um, that you need. So first thing we're going to do is to show you how easy and quickly you can get Dolt installed onto your machine. So I'm going to go up to our documentation. Um, I'm on a Mac, uh, but we have Linux, Windows, and um, you can also build this from source as well. Um, you can also head over to our, uh, our GitHub repository to grab it. So I'm going to copy our install script. Go to the command line and install Dolt. All right, great. So now we have Dolt downloaded. I just initialized a repository. So from here, if you wanted to, here's our command. You can um, you can run an SQL server. And connect to it like you would uh, Table Plus or any other tool. Um, you can run queries directly just through Dolt SQL um, on the command line as well. And then we also have all our versioning uh, commands in here to get started. So now I'm going to go to Dolt Hub and show you how quickly you can get a database downloaded to your machine locally. So imagine a scenario where you know you're using Dolt Hub or Dolt Lab to manage your databases. You want to uh, run some tests or make some changes to the database to see how it affects some changes that you're making to an application. Um, you can do that all very quickly if you're using uh, Dolt Hub. So from here, all I have to do is come to a database. So I have our Shack uh, uh, database um, here. Just going to go to clone, copy that, go back to the command line, and download the Shack database. All right, great. We have the database downloaded now, so let's just uh, switch over to that. There, um, yeah, from there, really, um, any database now, you can start adding tables, making your changes, um, pushing those changes back up to Dolt Hub, and managing it in a pull request. Hope you found this uh, video helpful, so you can see how quickly it is to get Dolt down in your machine and um, start using start using a database here locally. And just to show you. Uh, the database itself is here locally, so you can see the schema. Um, so you can start writing queries against that as well. Again, hope you found this helpful. Let us know what other videos you'd like to see, um, how to help you get started with Dolt, or uh, any ideas that you might have for use cases you'd like us to explore in the video. Have a great day.